Welcome to another episode of Racing to Learn. We are a nonprofit that uses radio control to get kids excited about math and science. And uh, we're just in the workshop today uh, doing a, a quick fix on our Arma Fury BLX here, our short course truck. Um, you know, we, uh, we had the differential blow. The, the differential is what splits the power uh, between the left and right wheels, right? You'll notice as I'm spinning one forward, the other one's turning backwards. Uh, there's a gear type differential in these that's filled with silicon fluid, so you can adjust the um, uh, essentially the 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 um, uh, the way that it, it distributes that power between left and right. If you if you put a thicker fluid in the the uh, differential, then it will uh, you know that that uh, response will be muted, right? If you put a thinner um, if you put a thinner oil in there, it'll be uh, there, there will be a quicker response, right? Meaning, uh, you know, it, it will turn tighter or whatnot, but it won't put down power as effectively as, uh, as a thicker wheel will, right? So just uh, some, some things to, uh, to put in mind or keep in mind there. Um, one thing that we did notice once we got this truck back in the road was that uh, the, the, um, the, the whole drivetrain didn't, uh, glide that smoothly, meaning there was some resistance in there, and actually, it's even noticeable to the point where if you put your finger on the gear cover, uh, you would feel the heat of that uh, of that added friction there. So there's something going on. Uh, my best guess here is that the the gear mesh is just too tight, meaning the the pinion gear um, and the uh, the way that it meshes with the the spur gear is just a little bit uh, too tight. So we're gonna go ahead and take off the gear cover. The gear cover, I don't know if you guys can see that here, uh, is pretty nice on this truck because it is removable with just two screws. You know, if you, if you compare it to a slash or whatnot, uh, the, the slashes, the ruckuses, um, the torments, etc., stampedes, they have three screws, which, you know, an, an extra screw makes it, um, you know, one more thing to take out. Uh, and you actually have to take off the tire uh, on the on the slashes and stampedes. I'll, I'll show you guys real quick since we have a slash sitting right here. All right, so to get to the three screws on a slashes transmission, you have one, two, and three. Uh, screws to remove and taking out this one usually involves taking off the right tire so uh, you know just just one of the advantages that the Fury has over the slash uh, albeit you know the the parts availability on the arm is is, is not as uh, as widespread as on the slash of course uh, sometimes you have to special order so let's go ahead and take a look here so yeah, that gear mesh is really tight. Um, if you could see right in there, I had put in a piece of paper. So usually, get the camera to focus here. Usually you put in a piece of paper to adjust the gear mesh there. Um, these are 32 pitch gears, which are a lot beefier than the 48 pitch gears that uh, come on the slash. And again, I can, bring our slash over here, right? You'll notice that the, the teeth on the gears here is a lot finer on the slash, a lot beefier on that, um, uh, on the, uh, the Arma Fury there. Uh, people will actually convert their slashes over, the, over to 32 pitch gears. You can actually use gears out of the Revo uh, and the slipper out of the Revo. However, then you can't fit on your gear cover. So your, your gear, your drivetrain there is exposed to the, the dirt and debris, which isn't a huge deal with 32 pitch gears. Uh, but, you know, it, um, I, I mean, I don't, I don't usually like having the motor and gear and, and drivetrain exposed to dirt and debris and dust if it doesn't have to be, right? Any sort of grit, sand, dust, is just going to accelerate the, the wear on those gears. So uh, if you can have them covered by a gear cover, right, um, even better. So having the 32 pitch gears uh, is, is an advantage that the, the Fury has over the, uh, the other short course uh, two wheel drive trucks out there. 
So anyways, it looks like we found the root of our problem here. Um, to, to fix this, um, you know, we'll actually shoot another video. We're at about time here. Uh, but thanks again for watching. Catch it, watch us, uh, watch us adjust the gear mush in our next video. And thanks again for watching. Please like, subscribe, and follow, and we'll catch you next time.